We're Here Coastal Bend is proudly brought to you by NEC Co-op Energy. Let's stay Port Aransas golf carts and Port Aransas. They go hand in hand. If you've noticed some funky carts around town, they're probably from one Port A business started after Hurricane Harvey. Patrick Johnstone reports for We're Here. It's no surprise golf carts are a big part of the culture in Port Aransas. Golf carts give you a sense of freedom. But Kelby and Rochelle McCann wanted to change the game with Sly Customs. It was just my dream to do something more custom and create a place where people can come and customize their carts. They make custom golf carts. They tell us the dream and we make it happen. But they also do repairs, upgrades, and for tourists, rentals. Each golf cart's its own little thing here. Some carts have their own personality, like T-Rex, the eight passenger cart that's lifted, or Joyce, a hot rod design named after Rochelle's mother. And for families with kids, maybe Mater or Lightning McQueen. It gets them excited about their vacation. But like many businesses, the pandemic had an impact on Sly Customs. Aside from it taking longer to get parts from overseas, beach closures hit them hard. And it really wasn't the pandemic that hit Port Aransas the hardest. It was the closing of the beaches. But if you don't need to go to the beach, you don't really need a golf cart. But business has picked up again. People are, I think, more ready to get out, more ready to get on the beach. Reporting for We're Here, Patrick Johnstone, Chris X News. Now, if you're looking to buy or rent one of those awesome looking carts from Sly Customs, you can get a hold of them on their Facebook page or website. Those links are available on our website, ChrisTV.com. Governor Greg Abbott signing a bill into law last night that's going to shake the foundation of college athletics. Senate Bill 1385 signed last night goes into effect on July 1st. It will allow collegiate athletes to profit off their name, image and likeness, something that had been prohibited before. Texas is the 19th state to pass the landmark legislation. Included in the bill are stipulations that athletes be paid, quote, fair market value for their services and use of their name, image and likeness, as in goes in the NIL. Athletes would be paid for everything from promotional appearances to product endorsements to autograph sessions and even training sessions.